Alright guys, we got us a load of nuts. We're here in North Platte, we're gonna go up to Scott's Bluff with these nuts. 300 and, no, 35,097 pounds of nuts. Scott's Bluff, yep, that's right. So, it looks like it's gonna be about 211 miles, four hours, two minutes, should be there by 4, 4 a.m. It's 11.44 uh, p.m. now, so. We're in the Fate Liner Cascadia. Um, with the uh, Legacy Sleeper, and this is just John Rudis reefer with my feather skin that seems to be messed up for some reason. But the right though, it's not that big of a deal. I was thinking about painting the truck so it match the trailer, like the front half of the truck being black and fading it in like I did on the trailer, or maybe fading it into the blue. But making skins for trucks that are faded like that is a lot harder to do than it is for a trailer. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Don't believe me? Try it. That's the reason I haven't done it yet. That's why there's always just been solid red. One day I will do it. Anyways, let's uh, hit the road. Got the minions here accompanying us. Bob and Fred. I don't know what the fuck their names are. I never even watched the minions tell you the truth. But we got them hanging out there. Got the guitar on the wall, flag going. Little bears are bagging a flaming pillow. Put get the fire extinguisher, put that some bitch out. Oh man, I didn't set up reshade. That's gonna set up reshade. Well, I gotta have the lane to get out. We're playing a version 1.51 point something S. Beta. to mess with these nuts. I will, bitch. As soon as the light changes. Ooh, MVT. Melissa. We got to uh, adjust the mirror here.
I'm gonna think of a skin. A good skin to make. Maybe one after like a movie or something. Well, the problem is, there's not really a lot of truck driver movies out there that people ain't seen. I mean, there's only a few movies out there and they've pretty much been covered. As far as, uh, American movies, that is. There's some, uh, UK movies out there that are pretty decent. That's 12th gear there, about 1500. Hello. Let's see, you got Rubber Duck, you got, or Convoy, you got Smokey and the Bandit, you got High Ballin', Duel, Joyride 1 and 2. There's a couple older ones, I can't quite remember what their names are. We've got Halloween coming up. I can remember how to do the glow. I make some pretty cool Halloween skins. And then turn left. I don't think it was that hard to do. I kind of like what my logo is on the trucks and trailers. They got kind of like a little glow to it. See on the GD. Turn left. They can make them like really, really glow, like a light. That could be kind of cool. Don't see it very much. It's hard to get it set up to look right. Truck traffic out tonight, isn't there?
when you make your curves, when you make your turns in a truck kind of like this, when you're long, you always want to make sure your trailer stays on the pavement. Um, if you got to cross the line or something, do it with the front of the truck. You got more control over the front of the truck than you do the trailer. Never, don't ever leave the pavement with the front wheels of the truck, no matter what. If it's not solid hard ground, don't do it. The police might not like it, but hey. In the end, it's you that has to pay for the cleanup. Whether that be get you unstuck or even roll over, which I've seen happen. Dude's on a two lane road. I like this, but it didn't have no wide shoulder. It had dirt roads. There's quite a few dirt roads that pulled off and everything. But you don't want to really pull down the dirt road because you don't know where that dirt road goes and you don't know how you're going to get back out. So the only option you have is to move over. But this guy, he moved over too far. And he had half the truck was on the pavement. The other half was in the ditch. And while the cop was getting ready to walk up to the truck, it started sinking down and it rolled over. Rolled over, took out a, a fence and a uh, utility pole. Me? I would have kept going. He wants to follow me, he wants to write me a ticket for whatever, but until I found a safe spot, I don't pull over. And I determine what is a safe spot. Well, we're getting 4.6 miles to go. That's better than a Kenworth. It's a regular truck. It gets 3.2. It's going to be coming up on us here soon.
lived up there in Indiana. They got a lot of farm uh, cornfields up there, northern Indiana where I lived. There's these. It was a uh, well, winter time. Yeah, you know, and the fields are all muddy and a mess. There's a kids, two kids that decided to take their jeep <laughs> down through the side of the road, down through the field. But she said it didn't work out very far. It didn't get very far. And they got in trouble for it. The cops came. The dude that owns the field came. He was pissed. And then turn left. Like a good thing I got insurance. Good thing they got insured. I don't know that your insurance will cover something like that. I ended up pulling them out with the truck. Oh, that was the least I could do. I'll give them credit. They. They got pretty damn far in that little jeep, but... This isn't like a CJ jeep or anything like that. This was a, like a regular normal driving jeep. Older model. Probably... 98, 99. I would have done the same thing. You have arrived at your There we are, ladies and gents. Nuts delivered. These nuts. These nuts to Scotts Bluff. 213 miles, 714 minutes, 50 gallons of fuel. $14,126 earned. Let's see if we can find us another load. Come me out of here. Oh, what do we got? Fireworks. Yeesh. I don't think I've ever been to Chad run. Well, we can do some drive most of Shadow. Uh, and this would not be the rail yard. Nope, this is where it says to go. Okay, one minute. We'll be right back with you. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's get this show on the road. Uh, let me adjust my seat and just a little here. Just a little down, just a little bit. All right. Yeah, that'll work. All right, we're off. Drive mill, 41,000. Had to get a drink and turn the air on.
Uh, hour and 48 minutes, how long it's going to take to get there? 90 miles. some pipe down there uh, building something And it crashes. No, 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 no. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's going to keep crashing every time I go to load the game back in. So we will go ahead and end the video now. I'm sorry about that, but I hope you guys enjoyed nonetheless. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share. Leave a comment down below. We'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.